You're hungry. Are you guys hungry? What'd you guys order? Uh, yeah, I had to let, like a second meal there, and we heard it was getting delayed. So I just had another bagel, and I'm I'm feeling it right now. T tactically, you looked really sound. Yeah, I was in. Right in the right spot. I was in the exact spot I wanted to be with you know 400, 300, 200 to go. Um, but yeah, Paul just has that little burst, and he, he got a few steps on me, and uh, yeah, just didn't. I didn't have a, a gear to stay with him and pass him, so. Hold, um, I was happy to hold on for a second. I thought you know someone was going to come up and catch me there. So, second's pretty good. When you say you don't have that gear to make the pass, does that mean does that mean you will try to adjust the way you position yourself? Honestly, I just think it's like a pop that some people have. He's got it. Um, just left me with like 150 to go. So, some things you can't teach or coach or train for. What what else changed? Apart, I mean, apart from not being able to eat or having like big you know, one bagel. And what else did you do during the um, Me and Evan and Andy Bayer just hung out, talked, wasted some time, joked around. And I mean, honestly, we were looking at the Doppler, the radar, and we're like, we could be doing this thing at midnight. Like, who knows what's going to happen? Um, and then, yeah, there was a little opening and we were able to get it in. So I'm pretty happy that we didn't have to go till midnight. 7.30 was pretty reasonable. So. Yeah, well, Dave Healy was joking on Twitter. He's like, oh, he's just going to send Ryan and Evan on the plane. Forget USA's. They need to get back to altitude ASAP. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Yeah, we were already thinking, like, yeah, what if we have the event tomorrow, but we've got flights, and, yeah, and everyone's got flights. Everyone here is, you know, going to Europe tomorrow, so that could have been a whole disaster, but good thing we got it in. So you're back on the podium. You're standing in a pretty similar spot to where five years ago you were just kind of amazed at making the podium at that point. How, I guess, how, how does it feel, I guess, differently now, being yeah, five years later, and you, you're back here? Well, it's good. I was, I was here then. I'm here now, and some people come and go pretty quickly. So I'm happy to have some staying powers, and I found kind of a sustainable way to train and live. And, I think this is just proof of that. So I'm, I'm happy to still be where I am. Some different faces, but I'm still here. Evan said that uh, some of the guys might be just coming from altitude, but you're in no, Poland, so you're doing your own thing right now. Why is it the same? Some people just come out of altitude a little better, and I, I just kind of feel a little off. I love it for training, but I like kind of having that month to get my legs back, do some good workouts. So just kind of what works for me, and it works for some other people as well. I've been training with Lopez Lamang for four straight months, basically. Basically, so had a good training partner. What was it like watching Lopez win the 10 It was awesome. It was really great to see him. I mean, talk about a guy who's been around forever. Jeez, yeah, he's incredible. Um, I was happy to see him win because I knew he was in really good shape. He just had to put it together. And yeah, he did. I was happy for him. You say you're going, to, it's going over to Europe for the summer. Uh, what, are, what are your expectations? Like, what do you want to get out of that trip? Well, I mean, I'm only confirmed in London, 5K right now. So I'm, I'm going to go to St. Moritz with, with the team, get in a couple of good weeks of training, kind of regroup from this race, and uh, hopefully have a good five in London. That's Whether that means a good time or a good place, I'll, I'm just going to do my best and see how it all shakes out. Do you, good time, I mean, do you want to be in a fast race where you can try to play with a 13 flat? Uh, honestly, I just, I'm going along with it. You know, I'll just see where see where things take me. If I just run the best I can, I, I can run fast or I can place well. I don't really care. So it doesn't matter. You, you, high place and I'm trying to place as high as I can. Yeah, and see what happens. Pretty much. All right. Let's